guys, what's up? It's Lindsay. I'm back with another video. It's actually been like a year since I filmed a video, which is crazy. I did I mean I never really posted that much on YouTube or anything, but it's still crazy that I haven't posted in that long. Whatever. But today I am going to do a highlight across the video phone case collection. I have so many phone cases, like it's crazy. I used to have like an addiction that I used to buy phone cases all the time. Four places I've gotten my phone cases are um, Best Buy, Target, Amazon, and I've made two of them. Yeah, so let's just get started. So, the first few cases I'm going to show you are from Amazon. And Amazon has the best Amazon has the best deals on cases like I've gotten all of these for under ten dollars and it's awesome that you know you can do that and they're so cheap and a lot of them are like free shipping too and that's just crazy. But the one I'm about to show you actually is my favorite case and um it was only $2 and I'm not even over exaggerating. It was $2 and it was free shipping and it lasted forever but now it's starting to get a little messed up. But I'm just like, I just love this case. So that one was $2. And the next one I have is like a one of like those wallet phone cases kind of thing. So it has where you can hold your cards and the phone goes there. And one really nice thing about this case is um, it has speaker holes so you can just be like, hello. And not have to open it. So there's that one. That one was about like nine dollars or ten dollars. The next one is Jet Tech. It's just a clear case with a bumper around it, and it's a black bumper. And that one is really nice because you can like see the logo through your phone. The next case I have is Caseology case. I love this case. Also, it's like my favorite color. So. Um, so this case is Caseology. It is my favorite color, so I love this case. I a lot of my cases like I haven't used that. Like I when I first got them, I used them a lot, and now I kind of have like a favorite case. But it broke recently, so I have a different one on now. But yeah, so those were the ones from Amazon, and now the next ones are from um, Target. So the first case I have is a lifeproof case, it's just a plain black life. I shattered my iPhone, so I had to get a lifeproof case because I didn't want to um, mess it up again after I got the screen fixed, but I ended up putting it back into a regular case because that case gets a lot of dust and stuff under it, but that one was about $100, so it was kind of expensive, so, but yeah. And the next case I have is, you can't see it from here, but there, it's the Apple case with the Apple logo on the back of it. This one I got on clearance for $12, and I used it a few times, it's a pretty nice case. Next one I have is an otter box. It's just gray and white. Nothing's too special about it. I got that for like $12 also. I'm like all about getting cases for good deals. And the next three were like in the $5 bins or whatever. And I haven't used them too much, but I have this one. And we have this one. And then that one. Um, the silver one I haven't used much, but the other two I used quite a bit. And Next case I have used to be my favorite case until it broke. Um, it like cracked, so it's kind of disappointing, but this was actually the second one I bought. It's so pretty though. I just love it. It's very simple and it's just cute. I don't know. But I bought another one of these because I was so upset because I loved it. and. That one broke too, so I decided that one just wasn't a case for me, obviously. So, the next case used to be my favorite also, but it chipped off today, so it's not my favorite anymore. But it's just this, it's Agent 18, and it was about $15, and the other one was about $15 also. And then these two I made. And they're all glittery. I haven't really used them before. Um, this one I have a video of. It was my most viewed video. So the next case I have is from TJ Maxx. It is um, Dabney Lee and it was about uh, $12, I think. 
Sorry, I'm not good. I can't remember what price is, but that one's really pretty. But the one thing I don't like is that it has white on the front and it doesn't blend well with my... It just doesn't look right with my black phone. The next set of cases are from Best Buy. This one is Isaac Mizrahi. And it's really pretty, but once again, it has the white on the front. I just It just doesn't look right with my phone. I don't know. I actually got this when I got an iPhone 6S Plus white, but I ended up not liking the white one, so I returned it for the black one. So, yeah. The next case I have is also the same Isaac Mizrahi, um, but this one's kind of chipped. I don't know. After what, having it a while, it got chipped, so it didn't last very long. And the next one, oh, and the, Is the Isaac Mizrahi ones, they were about like $25, I'd say. So, yeah. And this one is an anchor one. I don't know the brand of it because it doesn't like have, it doesn't say it and I can't remember, but I know it's from Best Buy. And it was about like, I think it was $5 or $10, one or the other. And this one is the one I'm currently using on my phone and I used to not like it, but I actually really like it now. I think it's really like springy looking and everything. And that one was also $10. These were all like the same type of cases. And then this pretty flower one, it got discolored really easily though, so I don't really like it, but it is pretty. And that one I think was like $3. And then another one is just this plain blue one. I haven't really used it much, but this one was also three dollars, three or five dollars. I don't know. It was really cheap. I got it like I found it on BestBuy.com and like picked it up in the store or something. And then the last one is just a plain clear one. It looks kind of dirty, but it's that one. And I love clear cases. I don't know. And it's cool because you know, like if you want to ever decorate or make a new case, like with the glitter or anything like that, you have a clear case to do that. I'm gonna try to start uploading more and just let me know in the comments below if you have a certain requests. Um, my next video I'm thinking about making is uh, my top five beauty products, $10 and under, because honestly, like this lipstick I'm wearing is amazing and it lasts, like I put this on like, eight hours ago and it still looks like this so it's amazing um it's definitely gonna be my next video but i could definitely use some requests and my husband and i are also gonna do the bean i think it's called bean boozle challenge that should be interesting i might film that tonight but i'm not sure i'll have to see if he wants to do that tonight but that should be interesting and i'm like i've watched so many people do it but i don't know as bad as people make it seem but yeah so yeah i will see y'all in my next video don't forget to comment below my next like if any video request like this video if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe but yeah so i will see y'all in my next video i hope y'all have a great day bye